So I decided to make two videos today, and the first one I made was on um, an event that just recently happened. Um, one of my friends who passed away and committed suicide. I'm, this is the only time I'm ever going to talk about it um, because I already made a video specifically for that. Um, but I've been very, very busy. Like I, and again, I'm say I'm gonna say it in that video. I've been very, very busy, and uh, I've been like I went upstate on a little vacay. Um, I came back, and one of my friends, uh, well, even while I was up there, I heard about it. my friend committing, you know, suicide, passing away. I had like my niece's birthday party. A friend from Florida came, and she wanted me to hang out with her because it was her mom's, um, like, anniversary of when she passed away, and I was really close with her mom, like, I called her mom, and I recently was invited to a party, well, to, uh, I'm, well, I'm not gonna say what kind of party, some of y'all know exactly what I'm talking about, but I was invited to somebody's party for an event, and I could not go, because so many other things have been going on, and I'm kind of, I'm not doing well with money right now, I'll just be honest, and I didn't want to go to the party empty-handed without a gift, especially for, you know, what the party was about. Now, all of a sudden, like, I, like, the week, like, this, this week, this is like the next week, right, and I decide, listen, I'm gonna, let me contact this person and just say sorry, see how they're doing, we haven't spoken in a long time, whatever. I call them, they don't pick the phone, so I'm like, oh, well, I'll just say something on Facebook, I see I'm deleted. So... For a while, I was blaming myself. I thought maybe it was me. Maybe I did something wrong. I really overreacted about the whole thing. Maybe she accidentally deleted me. Maybe she doesn't want to talk to me anymore. Maybe I don't know. But I know this. I am not a bad person. And I have become accustomed to blaming myself for certain things when things happen or being very paranoid. And I really was wondering. I was like, why... Why does that happen? Why am I so paranoid? Why do I think, like, whenever something happens that, oh, well, maybe I did something wrong? It's because of the way I was brought up within the Catholic Church. It's because most of my life I was told that my lifestyle is wrong. And it's because, you know, you initially, bl you initially blame yourself. You do. You initially blame yourself for things when things happen. Stop doing it, you know? Unfortunately, this is just the mantra I've learned this whole year. Damned if you do, damned if you don't. That's all. You were damned if you do, damned if you don't. If you don't go to somebody's event, they're not going to like you, or they might be sad or might be mad or whatever, might think you don't want to hang out, you know, when the fact of the matter is, it's expensive to go hang out nowadays. It's expensive. And then if you do go out, what happens? You got people calling you the next day talking about you need to pay this bill. You need to do this. You need to do that. You need to, you know what I mean? You have, to, you, have, you have to budget. It's expensive to go out. It's expensive to do things. And also, if you are wondering whether or not, you know, did you do something wrong? Did you, if you, th if you know for sure you didn't do anything, then don't worry about it. Cut yourself some slack. You know, if you're a good person, then you're a good person, you know? And I know that I'm a good person and a good friend. I've been there for this person many times. And if they don't want me to be there for them anymore, that's fine. If it was just a slip up, I still love you. That's fine. But I'm not going to go crazy over it. I'm not. And I'm done. I'll see you guys later. I can't believe I actually spoke about this, but I wanted to get it off my chest because it has been sitting like a coal, like a chest coal, you know, and you got to just, you know, just Vicks, vapor rub. You know, I got to vapor rub that shit out, you know. Anyway, love you guys much. Bye.